Hello, and welcome to the instructional video for the National Jewish Health Sputum Self Collection Kit. First, let's answer the most pressing question, what is sputum? Sputum, also known as phlegm, is mucus copped up from deep within the lower airways of your lungs. Sputum is typically thicker than saliva and can vary in color from clear or white to yellow or green and may also be lined with streaks of red or brown. In order to determine what species of bacteria, if any, are growing in your lungs, doctors must have a sample of sputum from inside your lungs to test. Using a clean surface, make sure that your kit contains the following. Instructions Sterile tube Biohazard bag Label and Prepaid envelope Step 1 do not brush your teeth, eat, or drink one hour before collecting your sputum specimen. Brushing your teeth and drinking or eating too close to collection time may affect your results. The best time to collect your sample is when you wake up in the morning. If possible, collect your sputum in a separate space away from others to help keep your sample uncontaminated. Step 2. Using a permanent marker or pen, Print your name, date of birth, and date and time of collection on the order form and tube label. If you received a pre-printed label with your information, you will still need to write down the date and time of collection. Correct any information that is wrong. Step 3. Now it's time to collect your sputum sample. Before you begin, wash your hands with soap and water. Be sure not to touch the sterilized tube or its cap as this may contaminate your sample. There are two ways to collect sputum from your lungs. The first is expectoration, which is the medical term for coughing up your sputum. The second is induction, which is the process of bringing about a cough by inhaling a specially prescribed saline solution through a nebulizer to help loosen secretions. If you are actively producing sputum and have no problems coughing up mucus, you can simply expectorate or cough the sputum up and spit it directly into the sterile plastic tube provided. If you can't easily produce sputum and you have the prescribed medication and equipment, consider a sputum induction. Follow your prescribed medication instructions to produce a cough that allows you to bring up sputum. If you are having trouble coughing normally to remove mucus from your lungs, consider using the huff cough method. Start in a seated position with your chin tilted slightly upward. Inhale by taking a slightly deeper breath than normal. Hold your breath for three seconds. Using your stomach muscles, perform a series of three quick exhalations with an open mouth, making a <sighs> sound. We will need about 5 milliliters of sputum to test your sample. Repeat the process of coughing or huffing and collecting as necessary. A good sample will contain mostly thick mucus, sometimes containing solid pieces. Try to spit as little saliva as you can into your tube. If you aren't successful producing sputum, no worries. Drink plenty of water for the rest of the day remembering to avoid eating or drinking one hour prior to sputum collection, and try again tomorrow morning. If unsuccessful for two days, call your doctor for guidance. Step 4. Place the cap or top securely back on the tube. Clean the outside of the container with a damp paper towel. Check to ensure you have a sufficient amount of sputum in your tube. Step 5. Be sure your name, date of birth, and date and time of collection are listed on the tube. Place it in the biohazard bag and seal the bag closed. Place the bag specimen into the prepaid envelope and seal it. Step 6. Mail the specimen at your nearest FedEx location or Dropbox. If you're unable to ship your sample on the same day, be sure to place it in a refrigerator. If you do not feel comfortable leaving your home to ship your specimen, you can schedule a package pickup online at FedEx.com. That's it. 
Remember, it will likely take several weeks for the lab to perform all of the tests necessary to give you the most accurate information about your sample. Once the testing is complete, your doctor will follow up with your results. Thank you for viewing this video in its entirety. We hope that you found it to be a helpful resource. If you have further questions about the sputum collection process or about this pilot project in general, please visit the FAQs on our website or contact our information line at 1-833-411-5864.